All right? Letting them know who they are according to the Bible. Okay? And it said that this place was in the spirit of Sodom. Okay? So, before America gets destroyed, it's going gonna, it's gonna to glorify and promote sodomy. All right? To the point that it was as it was during the time of Lot. When he was back there amongst them, them nasty, disgusting Canaanites. Which are you South Africans. All right? Which are the fathers of sodomy. Okay, because all this stuff that the so-called white man got, he got it from other nations. Nothing's original about the so-called white man. Okay, only thing original about him is that he brings death and destruction. He was created to be a perfect destroyer and a liar and a devil. All right, but everything else he stole from the nations. All right, because when you do history about the Greeks and the Romans, all their customs go back to them damn Hamites. Either them Canaanites or, or the children of Mizraim. Or a Kush, okay. So it's nothing original about this so-called white man, all right. But they was practicing sodomy, and they even got to the point where they wanted to kill Lot because he stood up against sodomy. And it's gonna get like that here in America, okay. Obama's gonna pass laws, all right. That's gonna bring death upon people that stand against uh, sodomy, and that's for that which the Lord has set up, which marriages between a man and a woman. Period. Okay. So Revelation 17 and 4. Revelation chapter 17, verse 4. And the woman was arrayed in purple and scarlet color. Uh -huh. And decked with gold and precious stones and pearl, pearls. Having a golden cup in her hand full of abominations and guiltiness of a fornication. That cup represents uh, America's philosophies. One of his philosophies and abominations is sodomy. That's undeniable. You can, the so-called white man can word it however he want, but it's sodomy according to the Bible, okay? If a man sleeping with another man, that's sodomy. A woman dealing with another woman, that's sodomy. And if they wanna mutilate themselves and, and call themselves of the other gender, that's sodomy too. And that's an abomination. Okay, keep reading. Jeremiah 51 and 7. Babylon had been a golden cup in the Lord's hand that made all the earth drunken, and the nations have drunk of her wine, therefore the nations are mad. That's right, that's why the nations are mad. Okay, because these nations, all right, they're tired of America, and they're going to destroy America. Every nation that has nuclear capability, they're going to rain it on America. To fulfill prophecy, even America's allies. Okay. So whatever Obama's trying to say, like like when he went to Germany, talking about he gonna reduce the amount of uh, nuclear uh, weapons, the arsenal of uh, Russia and, and United States nuclear weapons. He can't do that because every single missile that was created was gonna be shot on that that sub nuclear capability is gonna get shot on America. And that's gonna fulfill prophecy. And he, he, he can't stop prophecy. So to hell with him, man. Besides, he's a prophet of uh, Jupiter. When you go into that inauguration, he, he's an uh, interpreter of the will of Jupiter. So to hell with Jupiter. He don't exist. Go? Yeah. Uh, Jeremiah 51 and 8. Babylon is suddenly fallen and destroyed. That's right. So for, for the mass majority of these people that's not looking for the day of the Lord, they don't understand the day of the Lord. They don't understand what, what is going on. They're going to be destroyed quickly. Okay? And it said that the uh, destruction of America is only going to be one hour. And one hour, this place is going to be destroyed. Okay? When they shoot the missiles over here. All right? So that's how it's going to fall quickly and be destroyed. And it's, and it's falling. Every week we come out here, it's, the Lord is increasing the disasters and, and tribulations and trouble and anguish upon the people of, of the United States and around the world, okay? Every week we come out, it, uh, the tension between these nations to go to war is increasing. So the Lord is speeding this up, all right? Keep reading. Uh, Babylon is suddenly falling and destroyed. How for her? Take home, home for her pain. Yeah. That's what you Americans supposed to be doing. 
Hell, that's what they are doing. But that's an abomination. Because it's already set up that the Lord going to destroy this place, man. So all your prayer, your prayer is an abomination. All right? Because you, you, they believe that the law is done away with. They ain't trying to follow the, uh, the will of the Lord. They follow their own mind. So your prayer is an abomination. The Lord don't hear sinners. Okay? And there's no saving for America, man. It's, it's destined for destruction. Okay? So to hell with you, you, you phony ass Christians that want to always talk about they, uh, God bless America and you're going to pray for America. Or you want to take an American flag to church and pray over it. The Lord going to burn you in that flag. Okay? To hell with y'all, man. Babylon has suddenly fallen and destroyed. Howl for her. Take palm for her pain. If so, if so, be she, be, she may be healed. Uh-huh. When we have, we would have healed Babylon, but she is not healed. Forsake her and, and let us go everyone to his own country. And that's what you're seeing. Yeah. These, these immigrants, these people that's coming over here, all right, from other countries trying to establish a life here in the United States, probably because they, they, they job came over here, or they always wanted to come, right? Now they, 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 uh, they shutting it down, and they going back to their country. And it's gonna be more, it's gonna be more like that. All right, you're gonna have more people that's from different countries go back to their country. All right, because the, the, the money here is falling, okay? The national debt is over 17 trillion and climbing. They still haven't addressed that. They supposed to address that. When the year came, when the new year came in, sometime around March, all right, and a little bit after that. But they, they keep pushing it off, okay? 